Hey, Shalom. I want to give all praises, honor, and glory to the Heavenly Father, Yahweh. And His only begotten Son, Yahweh Shai, with the word of you before God and Jesus. You know, double honors to the apostles and the elders of GMS. All you brothers in the four corners of the earth pushing this word in sincerity and in truth, the confusion of faces. You know, Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai, Bashim Raka Kwadash. Rock a thumb to you brothers and your families and a few sisters. Alright, this is Proverbs chapter 8 verse 4. It said, Unto you, O men, I call, and my voice is to the sons of man. You know, so, right now, when we preach out there, we're preaching to the men, the men of the nation of Israel. Alright, the Lord is calling on to you. Alright? And, yes, again, a few sisters that are listening to us, but... This message, you know, is, is for the men mainly at this point of time. Because the order is Yahweh, then Yahweh Shai, then the men, and then the women. Alright? This is um, Acts chapter 2, verse 21. It says, And it shall come to pass that whosoever shall call on the name of the Lord shall be saved. Ye men of Israel, hear these words. You see? So, well, let me get next scripture. Um, a, man, a man supposed to, a man supposed to be teaching this word all right um this is on uh, revelation 21 verse 3 and i beheld a great voice out of heaven saying behold the tabernacle all right or the also the mosai is with men and he will dwell with them and they shall be his people and yahweh himself shall be with them and be their power you know, so the Lord is only dealing with the men at this point of time. He ain't dealing with you women on that level. Alright? On a level of being a teacher. Prophesying out on the street. Alright? You get your place. According to the scripture, you're supposed to teach the younger women. How to be obedient to their husband. If you're an older woman. Alright? And what else you, 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 I'm, I will get it in a few, but before I go to that, let me get it one more scripture in, scripture in Ezekiel, okay. Ezekiel 34 verse 31, and ye my flock, the flock of my pasture are men, and I am your power, said the Lord, your howl, alright, so now that we established that, let me go into what is the role of a woman? Mom, where to go first? Let me go to um, First Timothy chapter five. I think it's thirteen. This is 1 Timothy chapter 9, 5 verse 9. It said, Let not a widow be taken into the number on the three score years old. On the three score, three score years old, having been the wife of one man. And three score is 60. Alright, 20 is a score. It said, Well reported of for good works. If she have bought up children, if she have large strangers, if she have washed the saints' feet, if she have relieved the afflicted, if she have diligently followed every good work, you know, and a part of that good work is for a woman to keep silence in the church, meaning obedient, meaning subjection to her husband, to the men of the Lord. By knowing our place. Alright. 
It say, but the younger widows refuse for when they have begun to wax wanton against a Mashiach, they will marry, having damnation because they have cast off the first love. You know, because these younger women, all they're going to be thinking about is some D. Alright, they're not serious about this war. Alright, all they want is some D. And that's all they would come around for. Alright? You just want some dick. They say having damnation because they have cast off the force force faith. And we told they learn to be idle, wandering about from house to house, and not only idle, but toddlers also and busy bodies speaking things which they ought not. Alright? And as these younger women, they are not in order. Alright, so when we out on the street, we, we call in the men. Alright, we speak unto the men of the nation of Israel. And at every man, every man, to the elect men. Alright, I will therefore that the younger women marry, build children, guide the house, give none occasion to the adversary to speak reproachfully. Meaning you have to be in order. Alright, you have to conduct yourself as a woman of the Lord. You have to be in subjection. You can't be out there dressing like a whore and calling yourself an Israelite. Looking like a whore. Your attitude and your behavior like a, like a whore. You know? But on the other hand, you're saying you're an Israelite. You're rapping and you're tying your ear and you do all that sort of stuff. But your attitude is nasty as hell. Verse 15. For some are already torn aside after Satan. Now, let me go to um, Titus. Is that Titus 3? Uh, Titus 2 verse 3 it say the aged woman likewise that they be in in behavior as become it holiness not false accusers not given to much wine teachers of good things you know so all the women you ain't supposed to be out there be drinking a lot of wine being a junkard and talking all sort of shit all right not being accused not accusing anyone since you come back to your nationality naming and your calling and the Lord's name is upon you Yahweh Basham Yahweh Shai alright not giving too much wine teachers of good things that they may teach the young women to be sober to love their husbands to love their children to be discreet chaste keepers at home good obedient to their own husbands that the word of Yahweh be not blasphemed so that's your place, women. Your, your place ain't supposed to be teaching a man. Alright? The scripture said don't use up authority over a man. That's our feet. What is, what is that? Uh, first, first Timothy chapter 2 verse 11. Alright? So that's your place. Alright? To teach the younger women. And you have to conduct yourself in that way by being obedient and in subjection. Let me get this one more precept. Um, Just jump to the point. First Peter chapter three verse six. Even as Sarah will be Abraham, calling him Lord, whose daughters ye are, as long as ye do well and are not afraid with any amazement. You see, so you you all are the daughters of Sarah, and Sarah will be your man. 
all right our mother Sarah will be our father Abraham all right calling him Lord and you are the daughters of Sarah all right so you have to conduct yourself as Sarah all right so with that I hope this video edified the elect elect men of the nation of Israel and the women Right, all praise on and glory due to Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai Bashim Yahweh Kodash Shalom Shalom Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai Brachetah